When you hear the name Colt, you think large, high caliber, strapped to your sides. Revolver like uh, Wyatt Earp. Wyatt Earp and, and those guys. <laughs> But David the Marine, I see your war face. what big, bold colt do you have to show us today? I got this one. Here, let me get a little closer. There. The Colt 25 ACP. So Colt did start research and development into smaller calibers. He did. Uh, John Browning uh, designed a lot of the guns made by Colt and some other companies as well. Uh, and one of them was the 25 ACP that he came up with in 1905 to go with the Fabric Nationale model 1905. They're real clever with their names back then. <laughs> uh, people often ask, well, why the 25 ACP instead of a 22? Uh, a couple of reasons for that. One is, at the time, the 22s had the uh, lube for the bullet on the outside, and oftentimes it was sticky. Ah. And so that's not the best mechanism to have uh, going through a uh, semi-automatic. And the other thing is it's rim fire, so it's not as reliable as center fire. Mm -hmm. And so he decided, you know, he, instead of monkeying around with trying to make something like this work that he it would just jam all the time, he created a new cartridge, the 25 ACP. ACP stands for Automatic Colt Pistol. So that was 1905? Right, for the Fabric Nationale. Colt got into the 25 ACP game in 1908 with their vest pocket model. And that lasted for a while, and then they replaced it in 1958 with what they call the Colt Junior, which was made by Astra, which is your gun, the that's, Astra. That's my little jogging gun, yeah. Yours is Chamber 22 Short. This is Chamber 25 ACP. They did both of them. They made them for Colt, put Colt's name on it until like the 1968 Gun Control Act pre, uh, prevented the. Uh, importation of such guns. So Colt had to make their own, which supposedly this gun was actually made by Colt. You can definitely see kind of the father and the son relationship here. Go and break this damn thing. The Astra Cub 22 short. The sights are really tiny, but they're actually usable. Twenty-five used to be pretty popular. What happened to it? Well, technology. Uh, if you want a small gun, it's going to be a small caliber. If you want a three eighty, it's going to be as big as this. Mm -hmm. But then you start making three eighties as small as this. So it became: Do you want a little twenty-five quarter caliber, or you want a three eighty, almost as prob powerful as a thirty-eight special caliber? Uh, it's kind of an easy choice for most people to make. Are these hard to find? I mean, Colt is kind of. It's been kind of bought and sold lately, hasn't it? It has, but these guns are already out there. It's okay. not like they're currently making them. Uh, I think they made these till 72 or 3. And uh, as far as the collector goes, these are not the hardest guns to find. Uh, they're a fun gun. For as small as they are, they feel pretty good in the hand. And uh, like I say, the sights are small but, but usable. And it's a fun gun to shoot. And, you know, this gun or the 22 short or, or 380, you know, no matter what gun you get, guns, guns for, for everybody. everybody.